This video will demonstrate how to install a self-cleaning kit. Self-cleaning kits aid in screen cleaning, promoting increased screening efficiencies. These devices are made up of a perforated plate mounted below the screen with sliders placed between the perf plate and the working mesh. The sliders work to keep the working mesh clean by tapping out or shearing off lodged near-sized particles that tend to blind the screen and reduce the screening area. With an appropriate length center tie-down stud in hand, screw the center tie-down pedestal on one end of the stud and screw the larger size jam nut on the other end of the stud. Then using the side nearest the jam nut, screw the stud into the boss on the frame. Tighten down the jam nut to hold the stud in place. Using a straight edge, adjust the pedestal to a height that will permit the perforated plate to lay flat when installed on the frame. Place and tighten down the smaller nut onto the stud to hold the pedestal firmly in place. Place a rubber washer onto the pedestal. Place the perforated plate on the separated frame, positioning the center hole of the perforated plate through the stud and pedestal. Place another rubber washer through the pedestal on top of the perforated plate. Thread the spacer onto the pedestal on top of the washer and tighten. Keep in mind that the spacer has reverse threads. Place another rubber washer through the pedestal on top of the spacer. Distribute the proper number of sliders on the perf plate. Make certain that the sliders are turned on the correct side. Place the screen by positioning the center hole through the stud and pedestal. Place another washer onto the pedestal on the top side of the screen assembly. Replace the top frame and tighten the clamp band. Finally, thread the center tie-down cap onto the pedestal and compress the rubber washers by tightening. Keep in mind the No Tools cap has reverse threads. Your machine is now ready for operation.